What is up, YouTube? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team pack opening video. And today, guys, what we're going to be doing is opening up some packs, looking for some of these new legends that are in the game. Uh, as you can see here, we've got Mean Joe Green, Dan Deerdorf. Uh, the 24-hour Mean Joe Green is still in the game at this point of the recording of this video. Uh, we've probably got like an hour or two left before that thing comes out of packs. So I definitely want to try and test my luck, see if we can get one of these. I've had such bad luck lately in, in actually playing Madden. So hopefully I'm able to turn that around a little bit today and we get something decent in the pack opening video. So let's see what we can get today, guys. We're going to go in here and what we're going to do is actually open up. Um, we're going to do three legend packs and then we're also going to open up a 15 pack bundle of pro packs. So a little bit of variety today. We'll see what we can get in either of them. Um, there's a ton of great content to pull right now in both sets of packs. Uh, I didn't really want to do the legend pack because I'm not really, I, I guess when I look at it, or the uh, legend bundle I should say, because when you look at it here, I just don't think the legend bundle is really worth it. So you get one elite legend player item, that's great, but it could be something completely crap. So, I mean, that's not really a great legend um, bundle topper, to be honest with you, at least in my opinion. You guys can let me know if you think it is, but uh, my opinion is that it's not great. Not to mention these legend packs are kind of hit or miss, to be honest with you. There's a lot of just mess stuff in them because, yeah, you get five gold or elite players, but a lot of times your legend packs are five gold players, and honestly, there's not a lot of value in that. So, uh, anyway, let's go back here, and like I said, we are going to open up um, the three legend packs. Actually, you know what? Let's do the... Um, Let's do the 15 pack of pro packs first, the 15 bundle of pro packs, I should say, um, and we'll purchase that. We're going to do that one with coins, um, and then we'll do the uh, the legend packs with uh, points. So here we go, 112,500 coins. Let's do this. Let's see what we can get in these things. And then, like I said, at the end, we will also open up the legend packs. So here we go. Got some Bengals playbooks. Okay, so remember guys, some of these silvers are actually going for a decent amount now if you actually look. Uh, this one only goes in the Bears trophy set, so that's not worth anything. But if you guys are watching this video, make sure that these aren't going in um, some of these packs, or these new sets, I should say, that are uh, that are making them worth a lot. Morgan Burnett's are gold, so that's not really worth much, unfortunately. Not a great first pack opening here. Uh, let's see what we get in the second one. Mark Barron right off the bat, not great. Uh, see if there's anything decent here and also some of the just the simple bronzes also go for uh, a decent little bit now to be honest with you because they they can actually go into those new sets as well so be on the lookout for that make sure you're not quick selling anything I said that in a video yesterday uh, Antonio Johnson come on we got to get something decent here and I'll, actually some of these cards actually go into the uh, the free agent ones so uh, again be close or pay close attention to those those free agent ones can be worth a lot Jason Pierre-Paul is our gold. We get an elite. Oh, we get in a bonus pro pack. I thought it was going to be something great. It was not, but we'll get the pro pack uh, going. That should be something that we can um, easily do here. So we'll throw that in there. And we'll go back here and per or we'll open up that real quick. So that's going to give us an extra little bonus thing here. And we get an elite. Taylor Lewan. Oh, rookie. That is a nice pull. I mean, I know it's not worth a ton of coins, but hey, at least we get an elite and uh, that's definitely worth our pack, a couple packs actually. Decent pass blocking. His run blocking is not spectacular um, at, the, at a 90 overall, but he does have decent strength with the 95. So that's really what we look for, uh, the pass block, run block, and strength. Impact block, not spectacular. None of these attributes, again, matter, guys. Strength, footwork, none of that stuff matters. The run block, strength, run block, footwork. But um, overall, not a bad pull there. I mean, that's definitely a, a nice thing to pull out of just a little bonus pack. I'm happy to see that. Still looking for something, a, a legend of any kind. Uh, the only legend that I pulled this year that I can recall, I'm pretty sure the only legend that I pulled was Barry Sanders. And I'm not complaining about Barry Sanders, don't get me wrong. But uh, that was a guaranteed uh, legend when I pulled that. So, I mean, it, you know, it's it's not like it was anything special. I mean, it, obviously it was the best legend you could pull at the time. Maybe besides Dion when I pulled it. But um, anyway, we'll go back here uh, and we'll have to 
go back through the the menu just a little bit here unfortunately but i want to hear what you guys are pulling if you guys are getting anything decent in your legend packs uh because that's really obviously what most people are thinking about right now when they're doing packs is the legend packs so let me know what you guys are getting in those because i'm i'm really interested in hearing if it's worth it i just i look at some of those legend packs and they're just not worth it adrian peterson elite baby that's what i'm talking about nice 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 pull Yes! I've never gotten an Adrian Peterson pull in the entire time that I've played Madden prior to this. So that is awesome. I don't think Adrian Peterson is like the most expensive elite card right now, but he is definitely an absolute animal. I know people love to run with this card. So, man, I'm very, very happy to get that. Sweet! We get an Adrian freaking Peterson, dude. It sucks that he's a child abuser, <laughs> but, uh, I mean, at the same time, though, it's just a Madden card, so I don't really care, man. This is an awesome pull. Very happy to see that. We've got the elites in back-to-back -back pro packs now. That is very, very rare. So very, very happy to get that. Adrian freaking Peterson, dude. Nice. We might have to put that one up on pink slips at some point. Michael Ower. Uh, that sucks that we got the gold right out of the bat. But I'm okay with that because we got that Adrian Peterson, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Again, guys, make sure you're not throwing away any of these silvers because sometimes they go in some of these expensive sets. So uh, decent pulls here. Uh, with that Adrian Peterson and the Taylor Luan. Uh, still struggling to get past uh, some of these mediocre golds, though, like Michael Ower, man. That, it's just so frustrating that you don't get anything really of value in some of these pro packs. But what are you going to do? All right. Continue going forward. And Ben Tate is our gold. Yeah, not a whole lot out of this pack, unfortunately. Let's see if we get anything decent out of the next one. Ah, right off the bat, those... Those right off the bat golds are so brutal. They're they're so frustrating because you just know that it's not going to be worth anything. Damn. All right. Linval Joseph is our gold on that pack, unfortunately. Brian Leonard. Is Brian Leonard going anything? Nope. Nope. Just the free agents backfield set. So that sucks. Oh well. Uh, keep going here. And Bradley Fletcher is our gold. Damn. All right, we got a little bit of a cold streak going here, guys, but we still got some packs to open. Harry Douglas, man, we're getting that that gold card in the first item, like repeatedly. I don't know why. Not really uh, anything of value out of any of these. And just to remind you guys too, uh, we will be doing. If you guys are watching this on Sunday, we are doing pink slips today over on Twitch.tv forward slash Clickwood TV. So uh, be sure to stop over there. If you guys are uns unsure or unaware of what pink slips are, uh, this is a series that I do on Twitch, and then I upload it to YouTube. Basically, what happens is that we pick an opponent uh, based off of some sort of a trivia question. Like yesterday, I asked uh, a couple different things. I asked one of them was, "What is my daughter's name?" And so if you if you guys have paid attention to my videos and you guys are a long time subscriber, you had a better chance at that one. Uh, and then also, if you didn't know that one, we also had just a simple one, which was what game am I holding in my hand? And at the time I was holding Madden 15 Ultimate Team or Madden 15, basically the Ultimate Edition, though. So um, anyway, so if you knew that, if you guessed the answer to that, it's pretty much a random thing. Uh, to be honest with you. And sometimes we do actual trivia. One time I asked a question about the Vikings, uh, just an actual NFL trivia question. Sometimes it's trivia about my videos. So, you know, there's a different variety, but basically what happens is that you, you get picked or you uh, if you answer the question correctly first, you are the opponent that we play for pink slips that afternoon. And what you end up doing is you get to play against me in a head-to-head -head game. And if you beat me, you win a pretty awesome card. We actually have a Wheel of Fortune that we spin. And uh, then you get a pretty awesome card out of, out of that. So uh, it's a free way for you guys to not only play against me and get your game uploaded to YouTube and have a chance to brag that you beat a YouTuber. Not that I'm anything spectacular about Madden. Uh, but uh, you get that chance to upload it to YouTube. And then also, uh, obviously, you win a free card if you beat me. So anyway, that is the deal with Pink Slips. Again, we're going to be doing that this afternoon afternoon probably around maybe two o'clock p.m. central time so be sure to stop over there as we get ryan matthews as our gold son of a b man that sucks i'm i'm sick of pulling these crappy cards give me something good come on Let's see if this silver's worth anything elite vikings okay that could be worth a little bit at least um so anyway we'll keep opening packs here rams defense Come on. Oh, at least it's Kiko Alonso. I at least like Kiko Alonso. 
getting a lot of just garbage pro packs here and, and let me know guys if i'm missing anything because sometimes it's hard to uh remember some of these silvers that are going for a decent amount i pulled a quentin groves yesterday that was worth like twenty thousand coins so i was very happy about that uh, and that was out of a rookie pack. I was just doing that for a video, and I just happened to pull something that was worth 20,000 coins. Michael Bennett, Nard Jackson, Sam Montgomery, Sean Richardson. All right, so nothing really coming out of a lot of these pro packs. We still got the three legend packs at the end, and we'll see what we can get in those. Chuck Pagano, really has been. And, oh, Ha Ha Clinton Dix. Damn, man. I, you'd think I would at least pull, like, you know, like a collectible or something, like something decent out of these pro packs. I got the Adrian Peterson though, so I can't really complain a whole lot. I know Adrian's not worth, you know, 200,000 coins or anything, but it's it's a decent pull still. All uh, right, Lance Briggs, man. What are these garbage cards, man? Seriously, you gotta be kidding me with some of these. This is terrible. This is terrible, friends. All right. So, all right, I have my maximum items uh, exceeded, unfortunately, so I'm going to go over to my binder. We'll chop this part out of the video. I forgot to, to actually exit out and, uh, and you know, fix my whole binder. So I'm going to do that real quick, guys, and then I'll be right back. Okay, so we're back. It looks like we got one more pro pack to open and then three legend packs as well. So let's do this. Let's open this pro pack, see what we get in our final pro pack today. Wish me some luck, guys. And we get Mike Williams. Damn, man. Garbo. All right, that's all right, though. We still got our three legend packs, and that's what you guys came for, I know. So we're going to go open those real quickly here. Got some points to open them up with. Hopefully that gives us an extra little bit of EA luck. You never know. Actually, I don't really think it matters what you open them with. But here we go, guys. So you get three, or you get five gold players or elite players and four other team items. So hopefully we can get something decent out of these. Um, I know the, that some of the uh, people have been pulling some of the legendary stuff. So hopefully we get something... Wish me some luck, guys. We really need it here to save this whole pack opening video. Come on, let's go. And we get a... Oh, oh, oh what a troll. What a troll. It turned blue, and I was so excited. Dave Casper collectible, though. Nick Mangold. Keenan Lewis. Jeff Collins. Or Jed, excuse me. Oh, I said Jeb. I'm thinking Jeb Bush, apparently. Yikes. All right. Last card out of this legend pack. Let's see if it's worth anything. And Luke Jokel. So not a good legend pack here to start things off. Dave Casper. This is probably the best item out of the whole thing. I don't think it's worth hardly anything, unfortunately. So that's not a great legend pack, guys. We got two more, though. Hopefully we can turn around our luck here and see if we can pull anything decent. Let's go, baby. Let's get something decent here. Come on. Deion Sanders luck. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Micah Hyde, Football Outsiders. I think this might actually be worth something here in the next couple of weeks as they start to do the positional sets. And we get a Steve Young MVP collectible, okay? Doug Martin, gold. I know a lot of people still like to use that. Uh, if you have a budget team, that gold uh, Doug Martin's actually not too bad. Jonathan Stewart and the Steelers away jersey. So really not anything great out of here. Uh, the Alshon Jeffrey is a decent card. Um, the Steve Young collectible might be worth a couple thousand coins, but... Uh, and then the Football Outsiders Micah Hyde might be worth something in a couple of weeks here, a couple even of days. I don't know when they're actually going to drop all that stuff. But uh, be sure to keep, uh, make sure you guys keep your Football Outsiders, your Team of the Weeks, all those type of things. Because uh, it's going to get expensive here very, very quickly for some of those cards, I think. All right. We still got one more Legend Pack. Hopefully, we can pull something decent out of it, guys. Because this has been a rough pack opening outside of that Adrian Peterson. Uh, Taylor Lewan's probably the next best item that we open. Unless I miss something, which is always possible, of course. But let's see what we can get here in this final Legend Pack with points. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on. Let's get something decent here. Come on. Come on, EA. Hook a brother up. Come on. Bryce Richie Incognito, get two free agent cards, come on. Miko Ryans, and, oh man, a Gene Upshot collectible. An Elite, Fletcher Cox, final edition, there we go. Finally, we get something decent here, let's go. I don't have any idea what this is going for, but at least it's an Elite, and I'm happy to see that. 90 strength, uh, 91 Excel, 84 speed. I actually haven't even seen this card, to be honest with you. 93 tackling, let's see here. 
we got anything decent here. 94 for power moves, that's not too bad. 90 for block shedding. So this is a decent overall item. Um, obviously, he's really meant to play the defensive line. He's not really somebody you can audible or uh, make an adjustment for and, and put him as a linebacker or anything. But that's okay. This is a decent pull. I'm not exactly sure, like I said, what that's going for. And we get a certificate of authenticity as our final troll item of the pack opening video today. Uh, Fletcher Cox, though. Adrian Peterson. We got um, the uh, the uh, Taylor Luan as well. So some decent stuff here today. Not really a great pack opening, but decent enough. A couple of elites, and I'm happy with that, I guess. Unfortunately, probably didn't make anywhere near our money back today on our pack opening video, but I hope you guys still enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button. Of course, if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well so that you can uh, see when I put out some new videos. Be, you know, Of course, you'll also get the first update on when we also go live on Twitch so you get that chance to get over there and potentially get in on pink slips early. So thank you guys again for watching the video. Really hope you enjoyed it, and I will talk to you guys again soon.